So why do you think people are leaving New York State? You can make your pick right now on WGRZ.com slash vote. Well, two lawmakers down in Albany, they want to see why more than a million residents have left the state in the last 10 years. New at 11, two on your sides, Leanne Stuck spoke with one of them to see what their goal is. According to the U.S. Census numbers, 77,000 people left New York State between 2018 and 2019. Since 2010, that number is 1.4 million, according to the Empire Center for Public Policy, which says the majority of those people have moved to Florida, Texas, California, and Pennsylvania. So we know where they're going, but why? It's a significant concern, uh, and uh, it needs to be talked about at the state capitol. Republican Senator Jim Tedisco and Democrat Assemblyman Angelo Santa Barbara are putting together an online questionnaire and plan to hold roundtable meetings around the state to see why. I suspect that we'll hear about things like bail reform. We're going to hear about high taxes, but we may hear about some other issues as well. Governor Cuomo has his idea for the decline. More people are leaving upstate net. Yes. People will make demographic choices about where they want to live. Some of them are climate-based. They want to fish, they want the warm weather, God bless them. Santa Barbara said if this decline continues, we could face the possibility of losing a seat in the 2022 redistricting. We could lose representation in Washington, D.C. Uh, during a very critical time. Tedisco said this effort is meant to shine a light on the problem that's causing people to leave upstate New York and to find out why the Empire State is fast becoming, quote, the empty state. So now we want to hear from you. Why do you think people are leaving New York? We'll keep this poll going all night at WGRZ.com slash vote for you to join in on the conversation. Leanne Stuck, Channel 2 News.